episode, we're discussing high art. So, high art, the way I know it, the way I understand it, is um, one of those clusters. That part of this clusterfuck, claustrophobia, and all of the above, in between and beyond. Um, I, think I share many of the same ideas, ultimately, as Alexi in terms of exactly. personal art. Exactly. But mm-hmm. I probably have a totally different idea about high art than you do. Okay. I think high Some art things. is dead. Right? Well, yeah. it is. That's That goes without saying. Art is dead, for that matter. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Billionaires who have taken the art world in this direction where it's all commodity and you've got people without any taste at all spending billions of dollars on art. Popular end, you have Instagram. Spend three seconds on each great art piece, you know, and... ATM machine back in the 80s when everybody was doing cocaine, the Instagram machine. (laughs) Advent of the idea that anybody can be an artist and you don't necessarily have to go through any kind of schooling to become an artist. Um, You know, there's too many fucking artists in the planet. You You know, nobody gives a shit if Donald Trump hates black people or whatever. They seem to want to vote for him. Just read and they would think about things. I think this is the first time in human history where we can be distracted 100% of the time. That's why I'm coming with a vehement, vehement, militant view of opposite. Because to me, it's underground. You're not packing heat, are you? (laughs) My view, because I love answering my own questions. (laughs)